Zach Fox, the Atlanta icon and internet sensation, died this week at the young age of 28. Fox, whose inimitable voice and art skewered the figures of the silver screen and hallowed halls of Capitol Hill alike, has left an impression on the entertainment industry that can only be described as thought-provoking. Hailed as a pop culture provocateur, famous on Twitter for his tweets as booty math, Fox's life cannot be described in 240 characters or less. Zack's legacy lives on, not just through his body of work, but through the relationships he built with his upstanding character. All right, so let's say that you have passed. You got some mourners. Go ahead, I just want to stand up higher. Yeah, I understand, I look up to you. Yeah. So how do you want to be remembered? I want to be remembered as, as a man of the people, every day, sweatpants, dick on hard, hoodie on. I spread love, I spread um, the idea of community and black chaotic male energy, you know? Black chaotic male energy? Right. Fox's polarizing humor and incisive analysis of the world enabled him to live comfortably under the media firestorm that he frequently called down. But beneath the razor wit was a vulnerable young man transfixed by the seminal moments that shaped him. So I'm looking for a, a moment, you know, the moment in your life where it all came together. Yeah, uh, I would say um, Spice World. The movie. When I saw that shit, It, should, it changed me, like. So that was the moment for you? Yeah, just, just as a film and like as a movement, like as a kid, like, shit really fucked me up, bro. Like, that's. I mean, I can see it did some serious work on your head. Yeah, yeah, for real. While those close to him described Zach as having a comedically dark outlook on life, he never veered from the hope of a brighter future for humanity. I want to make myself a sex robot uh, modeled off of, of oh, me. Oh, I see. So you live on. Yeah, exactly. I see. So, you know, yeah. but, and it's like mass produced. And, you know, this nigga got Bluetooth. Sex robot. Got it. Fox's quest for fame stoked his fears about sharing the spotlight in the event of his untimely demise. So how do you want to die? I don't know. I just want it to be on my terms. You know, I don't want to die with a bunch of other people. I want to die on a day where only I die and like three other people die and they got less money than me. So you're the headliner. Yeah, yeah. So you remember like Michael Jackson died and another big ass celebrity died the same day. What was her name? No clue. Exactly. Spare fossil. A man who held the spotlight even in death, Fox's passing gripped the media's attention, entirely outshining those of his most notable peers. As per his last wishes, Zach's ashes will be scattered over the East River this weekend in a ceremony open to the public. Ah, damn, I got my ashes on myself. Bull. Did it your way. Did it my way. Atlanta icon. So much twerking in that video.